ideation, writing, editing, packaging, you got it all down. But when it comes to commercial strategy for your personal brand, you think it's not your strongest suit. You look at your fellow creators and applying what they do from the monetization perspective and apply it to your brand. You're wrong. Not for looking at others, but for blindly copying what they do when there is a much better tailored solution for your personal brand. Mosaic Framework is what will help you structure your business model. You are already using it and you didn't even know it. When you decided to pick up the camera and start filming, you emulated your favorite artists and creators. That formed your taste and style. You then started to learn how to edit, write, light up the scene, and slowly evolve the quality of the content you produce. What you were doing all this time was using a mosaic framework. You picked the pieces of different skills and styles around the web and made them yours. When zoomed in, those individual pieces could be recognized as part of someone else's style. But when you zoom out, you only see the complete picture those pieces formed. The picture of you creating your style. Now imagine the same, but applied to business strategy. I've managed business operations and commercial strategy for nearly 15 years. And I promise you, like 75% of people in the profession have barely any idea of what they're doing. This means you know as much or even more than the majority of the business folks. And that blindly copying someone else's strategy can backfire badly. You are a unique creator and your audience have its own unique flavor. Something that worked for others may not work for you at best or at worst, damage your relationship with the audience. Instead of copying the monetization model and the strategy others use, pick the bits and pieces that you know will work for your audience. You have a geographically concentrated, highly price sensitive audience? Consider small monthly membership fee and access to live events ahead of everyone else. Your viewers are fashion forward and like to stand out? Partner with someone like Sunday or Soul Savvy and develop your own sneaker. Or maybe they're very active and opinionated fans who want to contribute to the videos. Open a Discord server and for a monthly fee, offer them polls and discussion of topics to inform your next video. These are just three very simple mosaics that I combined by looking at the commercial strategy for other creators. And you can do with this approach so much more. Same as with your creative style, you can make the overall picture for your commercial strategy as simple or as complex. There is no silver bullet that makes a perfect strategy. You will build the perfect strategy that is only applicable to you, your brand, and your audience. And this is great because you can take everything that you do on the creative side and that mosaic and everything that you will develop on the business side, your commercial strategy mosaic, and combine them into a single cohesive experience for your audience. Ensure that the value your content provides matches the value your business ideas offer, augment or expand it based on whether your viewers came to learn, to be entertained, or any other value that they're extracting from your content every time they watch your videos. Check out my videos on the Jobs To Be Done framework and the creator personas. Or reach out to me and we can discuss it together. I want you to leave this video a more confident business strategist. You don't have to be an expert. As your brand grows, you can eventually hire someone to take care of your commercial strategy. But right now, between some of these tools that I offer on my channel, this is all that you need to start thinking about your next couple of monetization strategies. I made this video because I've seen so many times creators making very bad choices in either copying the strategy and failing to deliver the value to their audience or hiring someone and trusting them blindly to do whatever they needed to commercialize your brand and instead of creating additional revenue sources, they essentially ruined the relationship with the viewer. It is very likely that you entered this space to be a creative, not a business manager. And my goal is not to use all these frameworks to make you a business manager and executive. My goal is to make it dangerous enough to know when someone gives you very bad advice. You owe this to yourself for all the hard work that you invest to develop this personal brand and you owe it to your audience. I'll see you next Saturday. Peace.